folks on the on the floor of the garage remember we working on the dump valve now we got the pump motor circuit working we saw the test light come on uh, we also uh, had the problem with the panel light wouldn't stay on we found a couple loose wires on that and it's still working we went over the whole circuit all right now I'm gonna turn this around remember I told you I was hearing a click that's the actual dump valve right there. It looks like some debris down inside of it. All right, or it's just stuck, roasted, corroded. So when I pop this line off the other side, this system's gonna drop, all right? So I'm a little fat man a little bit, so I gotta get up back up in here and try to get it out. All right, so give me a little bit of time, but that is the dump valve. All right, so thank you very much. This is Jeff. When I get the valve all apart, I'll show you. Maybe I can repair it and not have to buy another one. But on that outlet right there, where that thread is, should have been a little screen and a little filter. All right, so this is the this is the front of the vehicle. All right, so while you're driving down the road, all that stuff's getting up in there. All right, so the system... So the system uses the dump valve, so the hydraulic leveling legs right there don't have to extend as far, okay? All right, plus it, it saves you a little bit on step. You see how the step's about a, a foot off the ground? That would lower it probably a good four or five inches. All right, so I told you it's a short video. This is Jeff from RV Diagnostics. You know how to get a hold of me. Email, Facebook page, RV Diagnostics, troubleshoot. Uh, the website, that's a paid membership. It's going up to 150 a year. That's $12 a month. Not a bad deal, actually. A little bit more than 12 I think 12 60 But anyway, thank you very much. I'll get right back with you. It's a continuation video on this. I'm going to tear this apart.